It's crunch time for CIG pertaining to Star Citizen Alpha 3.24. They actually went and dropped a Sunday patch. What a surprise, huh? Let's talk. Before we get into this video, let's let y'all know that I'm doing a giveaway for the Drake Cutter. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video between now and the end of September. Let's continue. All right, so CIG went ahead and dropped a patch this Sunday um, for Star Citizen Alpha 3.24 for a few additional fixes before we get into that let's see what's been happening in the previous patches which i haven't covered um when we go to thursday they had a few updates pertaining to features in gameplay under the location category they've added a uh, a final polish for the rentals for um at uh, cargo decks new babbage and orson so these are new vehicles that have been added to be to be rented um which will help with the cargo hauling career um, in addition to this, they've uh, made a few ground vehicle physics improvements. Um, it says polish to help movement in tractor beaming, which is nice. Um, with this one, they did a few bug fixes. Um, they fixed an issue where freight elevators at scrap yards have no cargo. Um, they fixed an issue where external vehicle storage can be removed and carried by players. They fixed an issue where other players' personal hangers show up on the mini map and may overlap they fix an issue where the drake uh, vulture external ladder causes active to climb 90 degrees to the left mid air then falls they fix an issue where medical gurneys clip under floors and in instance hangers also should stop the physics log spam they fix an issue where ships will sometimes clip through the uh, ship elevator um, when being called up to fix an issue where when a ship is docked and a player logs out the docking collar stops working for docking on the subsequent docking attempts with that they had one client crash and the server crash fix friday they went ahead and added a few further bug fixes they fixed a ui issue where it's uh, not updating whether the target box can be lifted or not until firing beams so now this is pertaining to track the beams they fix an issue where hauling containers uh, placed next to a hangar pad will disappear when a ship is retrieved. I didn't notice this. Um, my ship was actually on the platform and I, I put a few boxes there and the, and the boxes disappeared. So hopefully uh, they, they resolve that. I fixed an issue where mission reputation hits uh, unit max or overflow uh, causing reputation to be negative. They fixed an issue when another player is on a pad in a hangar instance on top of yours. You can't deliver or retrieve a ship and it reverts back to the ASOP list. They fixed an issue where item drops to the floor when trying to combine them in inventory. They fixed an issue where uh, large ships can obstruct nearby freight elevators when landing on a pad at outpost. They fixed an issue where total SU count does not update on commodity kiosks. They fixed an issue where elevators show blocked errors when attempting to store stolen mission cargo. They also fixed an issue where returning the cargo after abandoning the mission does not finish the mission. With that one was one client crash in a hybrid service crash fix. So now this Sunday, they went ahead and added another patch which add, adds two client crash fixes, four server crash fixes, and a hybrid server crash fix, which is pretty interesting. It looks like CIG has a hard deadline that they need to meet to get this patch out. The sooner they do, the sooner we can start seeing Evo Cadi having Star Citizen Alpha 4.0 or at least some tech previews pertaining to 4.0. Pertaining to 3.24, I was on it uh, this weekend and it was a great experience to be quite honest. It was very smooth. Didn't really notice much bugs at all, but it was a smooth experience. I was able to do some cargo missions and uh, not face too much issues at all. It was actually a pretty smooth experience. And before I let you go, I'd like to let y'all know that my organization, Phase 1 Industries, is now recruiting new and veteran players. If you are interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below don't forget to leave a like subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one peace